been. <laughs> and she came back and talked to me and Paul. Mm. Yeah. And she asked how Ben was going, and she put an order in. Well, he he was out of sight. And then, mm. then she went down to see where he was, and he fucking took two hours down there, fucking sit down and enjoying himself down at the solo. Mm. The girl, the girl goes, oh, I'm going home, but if you want to sit here for a minute and have a chat, pop. She goes to him, you can come and sit in my car, pop. He went and sit in their car, car while he was eating his fucking food and having a coffee. Who's this? His granddaughter. Who? Uh, this old bloke that was bitching at the nursery. Oh. Yeah, down at the BP. Mm. So he, his wife had a bit of peace with her nearly two hours talking to us. And coming back in the morning and having a look around come on. She'd never been to come on before. Mm. She never left home. She's always in the fucking garden and he's always buying this shit and surprising and shit. And then she comes and asks for a certain thing herself. And we haven't got any stock at the moment, we're going to order it in for her. Hmm. What sort of pine cone is that again? What do you that's call it? Radiator pine. Pine furniture phone. Oh. See this one? That's, radiator. that's made for radiator pine. Cypress pine is marine plate thicker than that. And it smells like cypress. This is radiator pine. This is white pine. Radiator. No, radiator pine is white. Cypress is yellow pine. That's the difference in pines. Wood. Hmm. And you can get a red pine wood too. Which is not a breed of pine. So how many pine. pines in Australia? Australian native pines, not many, they're a dying species. No, but how many pines are grown here? Five, ten, twenty? No. Don't know. Right. I can tell you how many, exactly how many pines that yeah. they cut down during the years. They have a five billion pines. What does that tell you? And they, they cut down five billion, they paint five billion more. They cut down ten billion, they take... Well, that's, yeah, well, that's what they call production, yeah. Then... Right, where's the biggest pine, um, where's the biggest pine mm. discovery in the whole of Australia? I don't know. Goulburn. Of all places, is the biggest pine forest in Australia. You wouldn't think so, would you? Oh, there is sheep. Now listen to this. Listen to this, Neil. It went for Goulburn, South Goulburn, Crook Rule. Oberon, Queensland, and northern New South Wales. They go all the way to Queensland in the line, straight line like that. In different sections of roadways, you go through pine forests. Oh, that's oh, right. And, yeah, and, and, yeah, the and, one up here. Yeah, 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 yeah I know. In the Blue Mountains, Lawson's got a pine forest in the back, a timber mill. Uh -huh. So, guess how many pine, radiator pines in Australia at There's any given time? There's a big pine forest up there at Sunny Corner, isn't it? That's right. That's another one there, that's part of it too. Yeah, that goes right up towards Mudgy. And guess what, Neil? I'm lumberjacked in all the pine forests. Oh. Mm. The biggest pine, radiator pine I cut down, uh -huh. was 16 foot round, uh -huh. and 600 foot tall, and it had a big hole like this in it, and you could walk under it. Because someone's already cut a fucking piece out of the rod part that went around modern, and you can drive through it from the car. And then the part that the, was still a bit solid, uh -huh. they just said, oh, I'll cut this into a square about this big, about that high, they made a pine butcher block out of it. And you know it's still in Goulburn today at the butcher shop on display. A pine butcher block. All it is, no legs on it, just a big block like that, about half the size of this, and they get bing, 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 bing. And guess what just got under it? A stainless steel plaque. If you turn it upside down, mm. it's got my name, cut by steel saw, Lawrence Bottle, Lumberjack, mm. from North Fishman. Because I just assigned them. Yeah. But I don't know if it's what the pipes by now. And that's so, that was... So where's that at? It's Goulburn, in... butcher shop. One of the Goulburn, old style, I don't know if it's still closed down or a new butcher shop there. I mm. don't know now. It needs to be near the Merino. Oh yeah. Across the road, just out the Merino. Yeah, the, big big, the big caribbean park at the big Campbell and Lane, straight across the road. Hmm. And that's where I stayed when I was very lobbing. Oh, that was also, when I was working for the OTA, I stayed there. Hmm. No cost. Because the hotels were all fucking red down at Goldman. The hmm. best place to stay was the caribbean park at the time. And, we, and, and they had a fucking five star fucking 
Spa, Swoomble, Spin Old Style Circus Trampoline set up in there, Carrion Park. They had fucking showground people living there. What did I do? What did I wear? I used to go to all the time. Fairy Floss, Fairy Floss, Soda, Fairy Floss, Rainbow Popcorn. Um, where are we? Well, Goulburn Showground. No, the Caravan Park. Well, they sell they sell Fairy Floss. Yeah, yeah. The circus people used to live there too at times. Oh, at time. when the circus showies yeah, were off the road. Yeah. Right, okay. Ashton Barbers, Perry Barbers, Stardust, mm. like at the Russian circuses. Uh -huh. Um. American Acrobat Service. Uh -huh. American Service. Now, you reckon Africa's got a circus? The troubles of the world. Well, I think we've got a circus. Yeah, Africa's got a circus. How many circuses we got in Australia of our own? Do you, do you know? No. How many politicians do we have? Fucking too many. Shut well, the cunt. <laughs> well, they make a good circus. Yeah, now, I'll tell you how many Australian circuses we got left in Australia. Mm -hmm. Seven Australian circuses left.